All right, guys, <clears throat> uh, this is Dizzo, and I just wanted to do a quick um, comparison video between these two yo-yos because, you know, they're so similar, and when you look at the specs on them, they kind of scream that they should be compared to each other. Um, so right here, I've got the Turning Point Cetus, and right here, I have the new Turning Point Soul. And... Um, Wanted to show them to you right next to each other and give you kind of the differences, what's similar, because, you know, this really looks like this soul is the next iteration in the Leviathan line, in my opinion. So, um, when they come to, when it comes to weight, um, no, let's start with, let's start with the physical dimensions of them. When you put them right next to each other like this, you know, we're looking at, they're, almost identical. The sole is just a hair larger in diameter, but you can barely even notice it. So they're almost identical. Um, if you put them next to each other like this, the sole again is just, you know, maybe, a, I mean, it's almost like a quarter of a millimeter. I don't even know if you can really pick it up. Just like tiny, tiny bit wider. Um, their profiles, when you look at them, look extremely similar. The, uh, the Cetus is a little bit more rounded off, while this one has a step cut. It's got a step cut there, it's got another step cut here, almost kind of like a Mustang, and then it goes down. While this is sloped all the way across. Um, Weight-wise, I was actually surprised that the weights were as close as they were. The, um, I put titanium axles in both of these. And the sole came out at 64.87 grams, and the Cetus came in at 65.37. So not quite a gram heavier on the Cetus. But the way that they play, <clears throat> for me, is the sole feels a lot, it felt a lot lighter on the string. It played lighter, it played floatier, um, while the Cetus tends to feel like a more solid unit at the end of the string. Um, as far as which one I prefer, the verdict is out, and they're so similar that it's like... Oh, they're just really, really similar. Um, some of the cosmetic differences that I've also noticed is right here on the lip. This one's very rounded on the Cetus. While on the sole, there's a little bit of a machining edge there. I have no idea why or what they did. Um, and you take a look at the inside of the cup. They're really, really similar, um, but they're, they are different. Um, and one thing that I like to do with yo-yos is I like to put them, both halves of them together, which seems to uh, they both have that speed bump right there on them put the two halves together Let's take the... Let me get the light shimmer off so we're looking at Man, I mean, they're so close that on video, you can barely even tell the difference. But, you know, there's a little bit of a step right here that there isn't right here. Uh, the speed bump is maybe a little bit larger on the sole here. But I'm splitting hairs. It <laughs> really might not be. They're uh, super duper close. Uh, let's put them together, which I haven't done yet. I tell you, when I'm looking at these two halves next to each other, if it wasn't for this machined ridge, this step right here, I wouldn't be able to tell the difference between them. Yeah. Right, so here is one half of a Cetus, and here is one half of... No, that's both Cetuses. Okay, so let's... <laughs> Okay, so I got a sole right here and a Cetus right here. Oh my gosh, come on. Oh, I'm all thumbs today, guys.
All right. I mean, it's almost, it almost appears just cosmetic. Like everything there, soul here, seed is here. I mean, yeah, this is, the soul, in my opinion, is a revised Cetus that's up to date, but they do play differently. Um, <clears throat> the soul is lighter and floatier. The Cetus is, feels heavier and has more of a thunk at the end of the string. Um, Really, really similar. You know, it really meant a lot to me to uh, to compare these two because the Cetus has been my favorite yo-yo for since I got it, um, and I've played a lot of different yo-yos. So I was really excited to uh, to see the Soul and see if it would if it would take the place of my Cetus. And right now, you know, I'm not a collector, so I'm not going to keep both these yo-yos. I'm only going to keep one of them because they, yeah, I don't know. Verdict's still out on whether or not I'm going to keep both of these yo-yos. Um, they're both great players. And that's about that.